Hi, this is Just finished up the inspection on your car and just want to give you a quick overview of your vehicle. So we did look at your car for the chicken engine light and you do have a misfire fault on multiple cylinders. So um, we will provide you a quote for that. We did find that your ignition coils are starting to crack. So we do recommend uh, replacing your ignition coils as well as the spark plugs as we do not have service history at this time. And then rechecking it. Um, I will also show you that once we get to the bottom of your vehicle. And then we also did a full inspection on your car and I'll give you a quick overview of what we found. Uh, starting with uh, in the front, the front cal area right here next to the battery uh, has uh, sitting water. As you can see, there is water at the bottom of it. And then this cable is the battery positive cable. So as the cable sits in the water, it can cause it to corrode, which can cause uh, issues with preventing the battery from fully charging or uh, having a no start, which you do have a no start right now. And we do recommend replacing the battery at this time so we will provide you a quote for that as well as replacing the battery positive cable and then also uh, we don't have service history on your car so we do recommend doing that and then you can see here your cabin filter is pretty dirty that is due every two years and then the day code on it is from 2017 so we do recommend that as well as a brake fluid flush as you can see your brake fluid there is pretty green it normally should be the clearest yellow uh, so uh, we will add that to uh, recommended repairs at this time and then also your driver's window regulator has a lot of slack in the cable so that's why it doesn't dip so we do recommend that as well and now we'll take a look at the bottom of your vehicle now moving underneath your vehicle uh, starting with your engine uh, for your ignition coils you can see them on the side of the engine right there that is the little uh, ignition coil right there, the black part, and those are starting to crack. So we do recommend replacing those as when they crack, they can cause the coil to ground out on the cylinder head and cause a misfire. So we do recommend those as well. And then also your valve cover is leaking and that is on both sides. So this is your bank one. And then on bank two as well, you can see it right there underneath the exhaust header, as well as your oil filter housing is leaking as well. Um, and then also moving on to your coolant pump. Uh, you do have a little bit of a coolant leak right there. You can see the pink at the bottom of the coolant pump. So we will provide you a quote for that. Um, moving towards your transmission. The transmission is leaking and it is leaking in a couple spots. So you can see it's leaking from the side over there, the plug in the front, as well as uh, the pan. So just to make you aware of that. And then also both of your rear axle boots are torn. So you can see here is the right rear that is torn. And then a look at your left rear is starting to tear as well uh, there on the top. So do recommend doing that at this time. And then moving on to your brakes. Rear brakes are at eight millimeters. You still got plenty of life left on those. All good there, and then all four of your tires are at seven, seven thirty seconds. I still got plenty of life left on those. Uh, no punctures found in any of your tires. And also look at your right rear. All good there. Uh, moving towards the front of the vehicle, and then a look at your front right suspension. Everything here is good. So all good there, and then a look at your front left. Everything here is good as well. And then your front tires are at 7.30 seconds, so still got plenty of length up the nose. And then your front brakes are at 8 millimeters as well, so still got plenty of length up on that. Uh, you do have some broken mud flaps. Uh, you can see here that the front left is installed, but then on the front right, it is missing. So just to make you aware of that, and then both of your rear mud flaps are broken as well. And then your front left... Uh, tire is at 7.30 seconds as well. So all four of your tires are good. But other than that, that is a free courtesy inspection.